Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. We're gonna save our game. And then we have stuff that we can do. Coops, my lad. Are you telling me that you're going with Mario? Um, that's right, Dad. I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. And then, I'm, well... I'm gonna come back a strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nicely said, young Koops. That's my boy. But always remember this. You are my son, Koops. And I am your father. That's... That's not advice. <laughs> Koops, my sweet. I'll be right here waiting. For you to prove yourself. <laughs> May I just add, if anything happens, you can always come home, Coops. Don't forget, don't you ever forget that. The village will always be your home. Okay, thank you everyone. Well, I'm off. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know, farewells. So where are we going? Let's head back to Roadport. Remember, Mario. The bearer of the magical map shall unfurl it before the thousand-year door. When this is done, the star shall guide the bearer to the crystal star with the pure light. I need to stop there. Each crystal star shall point to the next. That's what the book says. Which means, if we take the crystal star, we found back to the thousand-year door. So that means the location of the next crystal star will appear on the magic map. Exactly. Come on, let's go. Okay, we have stuff that we need to do first, such as this. Which we get a Mega Rush P. Increases attack power by 5 when partner is in peril. Which peril, I think, is only at 1 HP. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes. Um, I don't think there was anything else that we needed to use our power for. I did not want to hit that. I wanted to actually come up here. We're going to store. Okay, we will store the life shroom, uh, a honey syrup, the turtle leaf, another turtle leaf, and a mushroom for now. Just so that we have space. Okay. Uh, in. Yeah, I think we do have to walk all the way back this way. I love the music. Something wrong, Mario? You're um, shaking. Are you feeling all right? Okay, and it just restarts. I like how it looks like an SP. The new... Oh, it is. That's because it is. Mailbox XP, isn't it? Wow, neat. Did you get some mail? My dearest Mario, I send this letter in the hope that it reaches you safely. I am being held against my will in some strange place. Though I do not know where I am, I remain unharmed and in relative comfort. Those who have captured me seem to be after the map I sent to you earlier. They may be hoping to use it to find objects they call crystal stars. I do not know what they are planning, but I have a feeling it is not anything positive. Mario, please collect these crystal stars before they do. You must! They are already aware that you have the map, so please be very careful. And please, don't worry about me. Princess Peach. Wow, you got mail from a princess. That's so cool. So anyway, she's unhurt. That's good, at least. Yee! But I didn't like the sound of those kidnappers looking for the crystal stars as well. Okay, so... I don't think it's that one. I think we actually have to go down a screen. Yeah, it's this one. Oh, I'm missing. There we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Horse tail, thank you. Oops. go. Oh, they still give one. Okay, perfect. This is not a waste of time. Oh. 
Did I? I think I got the badge that was up here, right? Yep. Okay. We're gonna ignore these guys because we've already fought them before. There's Hookdale's Castle, which we don't need to do anything at just the moment. We will need to later on. Go down. Thank you. Okay. Now that we have um, the thin ability, there are there's a couple of places I can think of that we could go. Like here. I fell. Really? All the way back there? There we go. Okay, who is this? Hello, welcome. I'm Mer Lee, underground. Cute as can be a fortune teller, that is me. Lucky for you, coming here, I tell fortunes, have no fear. Let me in mystic power tell you days to come, more as well, for luck sits on my spells. What do you say, Mr. Guy? Want to give it a try? Yes. That's good. That's great. Choose your path to fate. Which path do you want? Uh, the special path, the normal path, or the cheap path? So these can give, like, double coins, double hearts, uh, double experience in battles. It can raise our defense in battles. It can raise our attack in battles. That's not good at all, but then it's your call. I surely hope that you will return with money to burn. We will do this um, later, mainly because I want to see how much money we're going to have after I spend it on a few things. So now, now we have the shortcut where we can easily go through there, so that's not a problem. Ah, perfect. My name is Dazzle, and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the happier I am. So, guy, if you have any star pieces, I'll trade you my badges for them. Yay! Come on, let's trade. Yes. Okay, what do you have? Attack effects Y, chill out, which is actually really good. Uh, all right, so we're going to do quick change immediately. Yes. What else do you have? Peekaboo, I don't particularly care for. Flower Saver is actually nice. PowerPoint Plus would be great. Uh, we're going to chill out and we're going to do the attack effects. Alright, I don't have any more. Maybe we can trade again sometime. Yes. Okay, so we're going we're gonna to redo our badges here. So we're gonna we're we have 15, so we're gonna do quick change, we're gonna do HP plus, we're gonna do chill out, we're gonna do the attack effects. So what I have four. Half the damage causes enemies to miss sometimes is not horrible. Power smash. Multi bounce. And last and P. So, um, oh, there we go. Quick change. Allow your ally to attack even after changing partners. That is a tremendous badge. And the fact we were able to get it this early is amazing. So now we can switch between Goombella and, uh, Coops with ease. We don't really have to worry too much about anything. Hey, look, it's Luigi. Well, hey, big bro. Fancy meeting you here. What a coinky dink. Eh? Who? Me? Well, bro, I'm on an adventure. I have to pre rescue Princess Eclair from the Waffle Kingdom. <laughs> yeah, it's a bad scene, all right. She's been kidnapped by the evil Chestnut King. If you gotta know, I met with some Waffle Kingdom cabinet members the other day. It was pretty crazy, bro. You wanna hear what happened? 
It's a pretty long story. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of my story do you want to hear, bro? Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. My big brother, that's you, bro, got a prince got a letter from Princess Peach and took off. Left behind as usual, I was cooking a snack at home when another letter arrived. We don't get much mail, so I was thinking, huh? This is what the letter said. Sirs, my name is Crepe. I am a cabinet minister in the far-off Waffle Kingdom. Our land has been attacked by the Chestnut King who took our Princess Eclair. I ask, nay beg, for your assistance. The Waffle Kingdom needs your skills. I humbly request your prompt to respond, sirs. Sincerely, Crepe. Well, I don't remember exactly, but I think it went something like that. With Mario, that's you, bro, gone, it fell to me to answer this plea. Hesitating, hesitating only a teensy bit, I headed to the Waffle Kingdom to investigate. Oh no, first I wrote a note to myself about what I was cooking, then I left. Once I reached the Waffle Kingdom, I met Minister Crepe, who filled me in. The Chestnut King had kidnapped Princess Eclair and vanished. Apparently, though, some oracle said a marvelous compass could locate her. The marvelous compass had been broken into several, seven parts by the ancient curse, and those parts had been scattered all over the land. Can you believe it, bro? Each part of the marvelous compass set was said to point to the next, and since one of the parts was embedded in the tiara worn by the princess, I surmised that once I collected all the parts, I'd find her. Smart, huh? The minister gave me the compass space spoken of the waffle fables. When it activated, the entire thing lit up, indicating the deep south. It was pointing me towards Rumble, Dump, Rumble Bump Volcano on Pudding Continent. <laughs> so yeah, here I am. I'm sailing out a rope for Rumble Bump Volcano. It's probably going to be pretty dangerous, but I gotta rescue that princess. <laughs> you want to hear more of what I've been up to? Just come find me, okay? I'll be around. Let's talk to this guy. Welcome to the home of my lawn, the Super Magician. I foresaw your arrival. I can aid you if you wish. With three giant sprites, I can power up your partner. Of course, that means I boost their attack power, but also throw in a move, new move for free. So, which partner would you like me to power up? Uh, we are going to do, um, we'll do coops because I like coops. Yes. Shazibi. Shazibi. Then you may go. I love Koops's just like small little reaction where he like scratches his cheek. It's awesome. So, um, he has, nope, nope. How do I, how do I, check moves. Protect Mario from attacks with a giant shell. We will probably never use that. But if we do, I mean, you know, yay. Okay. What else can I do? I can do this. Where we go, check the bad shop. We probably won't get any good badges for a bit, but you never know. Okay, what do we have here? We have unsimplifier, simplifier. Get more star power when Mario appeals. Piercing blow, power jump. 35, 70, 140. So we can't afford everything. A big welcome to you. Welcome to the lovely house of badges. Welcome. So, what can I do you for? I'm buying. What kind of bad? Special deals. You're looking for special deals? You'll find them on the shelf. Okay, what about... Others. What else do you have? Sleepy Stomp. Last Stand. Close Call. Flower Point Drain. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I think, if anything... It's only 52 coins for piercing blow. Yeah, we're gonna do that. That's the only one we're gonna buy for right now, because I believe... 
Yeah, so if we come out here and talk to this guy. Hey, valued customer, your contact lens is in. Please drop by our shop. I'm gonna need 10 coins for the contact lens. Yes, please. Thank you. You have nothing else that I really need. Wait, can I go back here? Oh. Alright, so we can finally give... Wait, who are you? Hey, 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 yo! I got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further! You got a favorite looking like a man with a mind for good to want to buy something. Jumpman badge. Increases jump power by one, but lose the hammer ability. Mega Rush. Slow go. Makes Mario sluggish so he can no longer run. <laughs> uh, we'll buy the slow go. Why not? We're not going to ever equip it because there's no point. I change the goods I offer from time to time, so come back real soon, all right? Did you bring me my contact lens, Mr. Squishy? There you go. Contact lens. Oh, sweet relief. Thank you. Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see. Oh, I'm so happy. Yes, because a unprescription contact lens um, will definitely end up helping you. And yeah, I promise not to stomp, stomp on your stuff. Oh, so it's you again, huh? Mr. Stomp a lot. Well, my name is Zesty. I may not look like a chef, but I'm actually quite good. If you bring me ingredients... My cooking skills burst to life and culinary magic happens. Want me to whip up something for you right now? Yes, please. What ingredients would you like me to cook with? I will give you a hor honey syrup. Yes. I'm going to mix... I mean, you're literally just cooking syrup. So, how, how difficult is it to... You just heat it up and then it becomes like... Caramel? I don't know. All right, the flame is good. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm not entirely sure you'll like this, but go on, take it, Stompy. So we get a fresh juice, which is basically a honey syrup, but also cures poison. So we're also gonna do a we're gonna do a mushroom. Okay, I'll cook up your mushroom. Yes, I'm mixing these ingredients up for you. So just wait. Doodle doodle. Nice. Sorry to keep you waiting. Go on, take it. Shroom fry. So a better mushroom that also does a little bit of flower points, which is nice. Okay. Um, what do I want to do? I think I want to do this over here. We have a lot that we can do. We're going to talk to this guy. Whoa, whoa. Hold up now. You're an outsider. Past this point is the turf of Ishnail. Head to the head of the Robos. It's ten coins to pass through. You can try and pass without paying, but I'm afraid I'll have to whip you butt good. Uh, I can take you. What? You've got to be kidding. You think you can fight your way through here? I'm going to make you eat your words, tough guy. Let's get this party started. So we're going to swap our partner to Goombella. We are going to tattle Gus. That's Gus. He's super annoying and tries to take tolls from everyone. Max HP is 20, attack is 3, defense is 0. All in all, he's pretty tough. Oh, and I've told you a million times that pointy spear of his... Hurts if you try and stop on it. I wonder if this guy watches people pass 365 days a year. Talk about a workaholic. So now we're going to switch back to Coops. And then I should be able to just power smash and do some good damage. Nice. Yeah, the fact that Koops already has, um, like, the attack power is three for Koops, it's, like, really nice. That's fine.
Nice. I'll take it. That fills up the audience, but it doesn't really do anything for us. Star power is full. And just a normal hammer will take it out. There we go. 20 experience. I'll take it. Crud. You dumb video game heroes always pull this stuff. It's ridiculous. You think violence solves everything, don't you? Huh? Don't you? All right. Now we're on, we're on this side of town. Okay. We need a key to get in there. Um, this is important. Hey, is this your first time in the Trouble Center? If you plan on using our services, I can explain them to you first. Need an explanation? No. I see. Then get out of here. Oh, I guess I have to do the explanation. Then listen and listen good. This Trouble Center is where people come with troubles. That's why it's named that. If you want to see what kind of troubles people have, check the bulletin board. If you're a nice guy, you'll choose someone and try to help them out. If not, not. Help someone out and they'll give you a reward. Probably not a bad deal, eh? But remember, if you decide not to solve a tr trouble, you have to pay to cancel. You got that? Well, good. Then go help someone out. Okay, so we have all of these various troubles that we can do. Um... And so, like, Garf, and uh, he needs a key. Magoomba needs a safe delivery. Arford needs a price adjustment and stuff like that. Um, so we're going to do Garf. They call me Garf. I have lost my key and thus cannot get in my house. It should be somewhere in Rogueport. I just need someone to find it. I'll be waiting for you at the house on the very back end of the east side of Rogueport. Yeah, we'll take on Garf's trouble. Do it and do it right. Hello, Garf. You took on my trouble? You? Okay. Then please find my key and be quick about it. If someone else finds my key, they'll be able to get in my house, so I'll stand guard. I think I dropped my key when I went to the bad shop, but I'm not sure where. And we know where the bad shop is. So with the troubles, we can get items, we can get coins, which will then allow us to, you know, get more items and stuff. So. Alright, there we go. We got a house key. Which I think will also allow us to explore that guy's house, too. It's locked from the inside. We can't do anything with there. We could probably squeeze through that crack. Did you find my key? Here you go. Yes, my key. I can finally get inside my house again. Home sweet home. Thank you. Please take this as a payment for your efforts, all right? 20 bucks. Like, that's amazing. You solved the trouble. Nope, nothing back there. Anything here? Nope. There's nothing here. Your house is worthless to me. Alright, let's do this. Squeeze through here. Looks like we need a boat. What do you want, chump? If you ain't got business here, then beat it. Where do you get off talking to me like nothing happened? Like there was no beating? Yeah, guys like you act real cool when you win, but when you lose, you're all, wah! Okay, well, I guess, uh, there's got to be, like, a trouble or something that's going to help us with that. So that can be later. Is it... Oh, I see it. I see a star piece. I want that star piece. But I don't think we can get to the roof just yet. All right. McGoomba, safe delivery. This is McGoomba, and I have a simple task. I need to have something delivered. Unfortunately, for reasons I won't mention, I cannot be seen walking around Rogueport. Meet me behind Zest T's house on Rogueport Plaza. 
Yes. Out of my way, thief. Okay. So we should be able to come in here. Come over here. Alright, hello! You never know who will be watching, so let's do this thing quick. Take this package to Goomfree. You'll find him in front of Frankly's place. And try not to be seen. The thing that Goomba asked you to deliver to Goomfree. Okay. A lot of these are going to be very simple. A lot of them are going to be very quick. Some of them are going to be tedious. There you are. Hello. Here's the box. The package. Yep, that's it. I'll dispose of this in a way no one will ever find it. Tell McGoomba I said so. And do me a favor. Forget all this. You hear me? It never happened for your sake. We never spoke. Forget everything. And when you give McGoomba my message, he'll give you your compensation. Remember, this deal won't be done unless you give my message to McGoomba. So now we just gotta go back. Makes it very simple. Did you deliver it? Phew, you saved my neck, buddy. Oh, I almost forgot your compensation. You saved my neck. You get something good. 20 bucks. Thank you. That's enough to get three badges that were up on the shelf in the bad shop, so... Like, we have enough to get three badges, which is amazing. Arthur, price adjustment. This is Arthur. I want to open a new shop, but I need to help setting my prices. But since I can't go into a competitor shop, I need some research done. I need the price of Fire Flower, Sleepy Sheeps, and Tasty Tonics in Rogue Ports. I'll meet you in front of the building to make the exchange. Want to take on Arthur's trouble? Yeah. This one is very simple. Okay. Fire Flower, Sleepy Sheep, Tasty Tonic. So all of them that are um, uh, alliteration. Okay, let's take a look here. Okay, so Tasty Tonic is 3, Fire Flower is 10, Sleepy Sheep is 8. Is it you? Sniff, sniff, you smell that? That smell is like a profitable situation. Yes, indeed. Looks like my star is finally starting to shine. Not that it's any of your business. Um, is it you? Looking for this guy who defrauded me with a fake credit card the other day? If you find that jerk, give me a smack for him. Or give him a smack for him. Is it you? Hey, you don't have any good jobs, do you? You know, easy work, great pay, or at least something easy. I don't like lift. I don't do any heavy lifting, and I gotta get paid cash. Is it you? Who is this guy? Who's the guy I'm looking for? One, two, three, four. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I have, like, a trouble list in my journal? Catalog, map, badges. Recipes. Ooh. Hey, two out of 57. I'll take it. Um, okay. Where, where is this guy? Hey, this area is the turf of Ishnail and the Robo Band of Thieves. I don't know what brings you here, but if you think you're going to meet my boss, ha. Is it you? Yes, I did. Perfect. Okay, I'm ready. First, how much are the Fire Flowers? Ten coins. Sleepy Sheep was eight. Tasty Tonic was three. Wow, that's rough. Those are some low prices. I can't believe they're selling that low. Even if I try to compete with them, I don't think I can profit. But it is certainly helpful information. Here's your reward. Good work. 20 more coins. I'll take it. Goomther! Find this guy! Hey, 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 hey! My name is Goomther. Please find the guy that pulled off credit card fraud for me. 
I'll be in Rogueport Plaza so we can talk to me. Yes. Okay. So there's... So we just talked to that guy, too. Or at least the one with the trouble. We just now have to go talk to him again. There you are. You look like a... Uh, no, that's not right. Was it you? No, it was the mouse. That's right. No, it was... Wow, I completely missed everybody. It's this Goomba. You're the animal of trouble, aren't you? Then listen up. Larson the Bandit pulled some credit card fraud on me and took my dough. I want to rough him up for it, but the guy is too wise and I can never catch him. He's hiding somewhere here in Rogueport, so if you... So I want you to find him. By the way, Bandits are those guys in the blue outfits who wear masks. There are several in Rogueport, but this one will fess up once you grill him. Do this and you'll get your reward. I'm counting on you. I think I know where this guy is, actually. I think he's over here. And then back here. You got a problem? What are you looking at? Unless you got business with me, Scram. What? You want me to return the money I swindled? What are you, the fraud police? Sheesh. How did I let myself get caught? Okay, he ran away somewhere. That's not the right one. Let's go this way, I guess. I don't know where he runs off to. I just knew, like, he started there. Did he run into this building? Nope, that's the guy that stole our money. And they are different people. Is he over here? Nope. He could be in the, um... Down by the docks. There he is. Cripes, the fraud police. You don't give up easy, do you? You can't make me pay. Didn't even see him go up the stairs, but I know he's up the stairs. I'm going to guess he hides in the, uh, in the back now. I'm going to guess over here. Nope. Over here? Yep. Cripes, the fraud police. Yup. We shoot. You're serious. <laughs> Fine. I'm a man. Do with me as you will. Hey, 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 hey. Looks like you caught him. Nice. Here's your reward. 20 bucks. So, since it looks like you're out of, all out of dough, I'll take it out of your hide. Eek. No, please. Kick. Kick. <laughs> we solved the trouble. Yay! Alright. What is that? We made 80 bucks already? So that's nice. Moosemillion, hit me please. Moosemillion here, I need someone, some help jogging my memory. Meet me in Rogueport Square in front of the shop. Yes. Alright, where are you, buddy? Is that you? You accept my trouble. I smell it. Thank you. I found a good lead on a way to make money, but I sort of forgot about it. So, I want you to sh I want to use shock treatment to try and remember it. Yes, indeedy. Try keep hitting me in the head with a hammer until I remember. But be careful. If you hit me after I remember, I'll forget again. Okay, let's do this. Use B. I just can't remember. 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 Seven, eight, nine, ten. Nope, it's. But we can definitely try again because I'm sure I'll remember it eventually. I think I need to go slightly faster.
Okay, he remembered. That's it. I remembered now. I have to buy a sleepy sheep at the shop in Rogueport and sell it for a two-coin profit in Petalburg. <laughs> I'll let that be your reward. Don't spend all those profits. It's a, it's a lot. Like, even if I emptied all of our gear, it's only 20 coins to do that trek, which... Eh. Eh. All right, let's see what else we have. Bomberto. This is Bomberto, and I need you to do some shopping. Please come right quick, because I'm starving. Meet me out in Rogueport by the docks. Yes, please. Da 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 Alright, so obviously Bomberto is one of the bombs. I'm gonna guess it's one of the big bombs. So like this guy. No matter how much I work, it seems like I'll never get filthy rich. Of course I ain't got a choice. Gotta work the live to live. I mean, who fa fa did Okay, it's not you. Is there a bomb guy over here just standing? Who are you? Hey, you're Mario. Yeah. Wow, this is cool. I never thought I'd meet a celebrity out here. Ooh, I know. Do you want to make an investment, Mario? My name's Lumpy, and I'm heading out to dry dry desert to prospect for oil. I've lived my life hoping to get rich quick, and now my chance has come. But I still don't have enough startup funds. Could you please lend me some money? I'll accept initial payments of uh, 100 coins or more. All right, here you go. Thank you so much. You won't regret it. All right, we'll leave that be. Is it you? Listen, mate, you're running all sorts of trouble if you don't keep your eyes peeled. There's rogue poor after. Okay, well, you're not helpful. Where's where's the guy I need? Is it this guy? Move it, you like Oh! You took all my trouble, eh? My wife bought my lunchbox for me, but it was empty when I opened it. I'm so hungry I could eat walrus whiskers. You gotta bring me something to eat. How about a, um, let's see, um, anything. As long as it's food. Now get to it. I think I have a mushroom, right? I do. <gasps> no, let's give him a shroom fry. Shroom fry. Hey, that looks right tasty. Chomp, nom, nom. Yeah, I hit the spot. Now here's your reward. 11 coins. That's it? Thanks, mate. Well, I mean, I can just make another one. That's not a problem. All right. Let's see if any of these other ones are still in Rogueport. If they are, we'll do uh, one more in this video. If they are based in Petalburg, then I will wait. And we will do those in the next video because that's a lot of back and forth. Open. Thank you. Kupuk is definitely um, in whatever. Plenty. Order me an item. Our shop inventory is low. I need somebody to help me restock. Please come to the shop in Rogueport Square. Perfect. Do it and do it right. I think I may have just screwed ourselves too because I think I was supposed to withdraw the courage shells because I think this is the courage shell one. Welcome, yes. Welcome to the Toad Bros Bazaar. Ah, you accept my trouble, fella. We're having a really hard time finding courage cells. I need to bring five from anywhere. Five courage cells. I will withdraw. Perfect. Guess what I'm gonna withdraw, buddy. Oh, I have a couple of horse tails that I could use. Yeah, I have a horsetail there that I could cook up. Alright. Here's a courage cell. Here's a courage cell. 
Ah, thank you. That's five. You're done. Well, here's your reward. Hope you like it. Ultra Shroom. Thank you so much. Really, you helped me. Beautiful. We're going to cook that up right now. We are going to cook up... Well, first we're going to cook up the horsetail. Just so I can see what that becomes. Because I don't remember. Fire's good. Fire's real good. For Oh, fire's not great. <laughs> that didn't turn out that right. So we ended up getting a mistake. Cool. <laughs> And we're gonna we're gonna cook the uh, ultra shroom. The ultra shroom should be fine. It should not give me a shroom fry. Should give me like an ultra shroom fry or something like that is my guess. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm not sure. Blah blah blah. Shroom steak. There we go. Sweet. So that is, uh, that is two more recipes we got. So, obviously, like, uh, made with a mushroom or super shroom. Made with an ultra shroom. So there's something else here that we need to make. Mistake. Failed attempt. Replenishes one HP made by mixing incompatible ingredients. <laughs> so, when, uh, we come back, um, we have two more troubles we can do. We have this side of Rogueport we can explore. Um, maybe we'll get more money in which then maybe we'll be able to donate some more to the guy who wants to drill oil. So when we come back, more of this. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys then.